storms. Let's go to Chief Meteorologist Mike Nelson with the very latest on a very active day. Mike? It has been. Let me start out with a time lapse over the city. I'll step out of the way and you can see the clouds kind of cleared for a bit and then just recently we've had a little shower move through and you can see there's a little rain falling over the downtown area even though the skies are starting to clear rather quickly. This is what that looks like. These are very light little showers in Denver. I don't expect we'll see a lot more than that here. There are scattered showers and storms non-severe in the mountains. The heavy your storms are out on the eastern plains. That's where we have two warnings. One Washington County near Akron, one southern Washington County, northern Lincoln County. And we have eyes on the skies for both of these with our exclusive Vera wireless camera network. No other TV station can show you these pictures and you can see the rain falling in the Akron area right now and the very ominous looking skies looking north from Lyman at the moment. Our weather headline strong storms to the east. We'll have a few light ones around here. Slightly cooler tomorrow. More storms are possible in the afternoon and a big warm up along with drier weather heading into the weekend. As far as the weather in Denver today, clearing right now off to the west. We hit 83, 77 is the average, 94 is the record. No precipitation so far today out at DIA where it's 79, 75 downtown. Barometer rising, winds from the northwest at 15, and the air is pretty dry. The dew point has dropped to 38, so I don't think we'll see our storms be strong here. The air is too dry, but out to the East of us, they will continue to get some stronger storms just along and east of this weather front. That's going to stick around for tomorrow, but it means the higher humidity early is north and east of us, mostly clear across the state. Morning lows are going to be around 50 for Denver, but as cool as 34 at Leadville, and we'll see 38 Kremlin Grand Lake and 36 at Walden. Tomorrow morning, mostly clear skies are expected. By the time we get to midday, clouds will start to build as a little cold front slips through and in the afternoon, there will be scattered storms expected, although not a lot of severe weather near the metro. Slightly cooler tomorrow to the south and east, still in the mid 80s. So here's the map tomorrow. Strongest storms east of us. Looking ahead, still a few storms possible Friday and Saturday because that front kind of hangs around and then it lifts north and we are warm and dry, hottest weather of the year coming up in the seven day. Scattered storms tomorrow, Friday and Saturday, but not a lot of them. A little bit cooler for the next two days. Then by Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, look at that upper 80s to low 90s, hottest weather of the year and generally dry late in the weekend through Tuesday of next week. Back Thank to you.